Hello, I'm Melissa from NorthlandExpress.com, and I'm here on site for a DIY fireplace makeover. It's going to be a complete DIY experience with products from NorthlandExpress.com. This is a four-part video series, and this is the second video where we're cleaning and inspecting the firebox. This is the part of the process where we're going to clean out and check the inside of the fireplace for damage and give it a good thorough cleaning and refreshing. We started first by removing the ashes from the fireplace and the old fireplace grate. There were a lot of ashes left behind from the past use of the fireplace and we used the Hearth Country Ash Vacuum to help the cleaning process along. We started by first cleaning the majority of the ash and large debris from the fireplace with an ash bucket and shovel and then came back in with the ash vacuum to get the rest. The Hearth Country Ash Vacuum made the process much easier to deal with because it kept the dust levels to a minimum. It also has great suction, so we were able to get the job done quickly and efficiently. Once the ashes in the old worn out fireplace grate were removed, we were able to see what we needed to do. Like I mentioned in the first video of our series, this chimney had never had a cap, so the metal of the firebox had started to rust because of the moisture that had come down the chimney over the years. This was fixable, and the next thing that we did was start the rust removal process in the firebox so that we could give it a fresh coat of paint. We used steel wool and stove bright paint prep to prepare the surface for painting. This was a time consuming task as we wanted to make sure that we had as much of the rust and debris off as possible so that we could paint it. The Stove Bright Paint Prep was an amazing product to use for this part of the process and it smelled better than most prep products because it had a citrus scent. Once all the rust was removed and the surface was prepped, it was time to paint the firebox. We used the brushable high temp Stove Bright paint in satin black. And this paint is also available in aerosol cans, but we were working in a small space so we decided to use the brush on version of it. We applied the paint and it was obvious right away that this was going to make a dramatic difference. The entire firebox was coated with one thin coat as recommended and it covered extremely well. If you didn't know it had been painted, you wouldn't know that it wasn't brand new. This fireplace remodel is coming along very quickly and very nicely. Take a look at the before and after of the firebox alone and you'll see what just a little work can do. And so far we've used consumer products that are consumer friendly and don't require that you're a professional. This leads us up to the third video in our series, where we're literally going to give this fireplace a facelift. Next, we'll be cleaning the bricks surrounding the fireplace and dressing up this hearth with a new mantle and fireplace door. Keep watching to see how easy it is to bring an old fireplace from drab to fab with products from Northline